grip tip. Okay, you're gonna love this one. This has to do with, you know, I've, I've talked about doing different kinds of exercise during the off season, things that are maybe not specifically swimming, cycling, and running. So what other sports do you like to do that are sort of offshoots of those, or maybe don't have anything to do with swimming, cycling, and running? Do those sports as part of your consistency in exercise, just so that you feel good, you're doing something different, you're giving your, your, your mind that, that relaxation. You know, they're not your primary sport, so if you cut a workout short, no big deal. If, if you don't feel like going hard, no big deal. If you wanna knock it out, no problem. That's a great way to build a big base of extra fitness that will help you. It's sort of like creating stability in your fitness that you, you just can't get from doing very specific sports stuff. You know, you look at a lot of other athletes in other sports, speed, cater, speed skaters, cyclists, skiers. In their off season, they do all the stuff that we do in our season so that when they go back to their key sports, they have this nice, broad base of fitness. That, that's what I did. I would surf a ton in the off season. It's not swimming, but it was close. I would do some mountain biking. It's not road cycling, but it's close. I would do some crazy long ass hikes on hilly mountainous terrain. Not running, but close. And you know what that did? That gave me that deep, broad base of physical fitness that then once I started back into my real training, it just, it just gave me that little extra and it was a little oomph that you just don't get from doing your three key sports. It's the off season, try it out. What are you gonna do that's different? Grip tip for the day.